The National Agency for Science and Engineering Infrastructure, NACENI, has unveiled the NACENI Portland Auto Gas and Training Center located in Kubwa, Abuja. It is the second compressed natural gas CNG center in Abuja by the agency. The first one is located at Utako District, Abuja Municipal Area Council, signaling the federal government's accelerated shift towards cleaner and more affordable energy for transportation while reducing reliance on petrol and lowering carbon emissions. The facility, a collaboration by Naseni and Portland Gas Limited, was inaugurated by the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Right Honorable Tajuddin Abbas. With a capacity to convert up to 20 vehicles daily, the Naseni Portland CNG hub at Kubwa is part of a broader national push to scale up alternative fuel solutions as global energy pressures and domestic fuel subsidy removals strain consumer budgets. Speaking at the ceremony, the Executive Vice Chairman and Chief Executive Officer of Naseni, Mr. Khalil Suleiman Halilu, described the CNG Auto Gas Center as a milestone under the President Bola Ahmed Tinubu's Renewed Hope Agenda, which emphasizes sustainability, innovation, and inclusive industrial growth. On an average, the Nigerians spend over 40% of their daily earnings on fuel. And that's one of the highest fuel cost burdens anywhere in the world. Now imagine if you can cut that by half while reducing harmful emission and extending not just our, not just our lives, but that of our car engines. This is not just a vision, it's a reality we are working towards. And this Naseni Portland Daughter Station here in Kubwa is designed to help achieve exactly that. This facility with CNG conversion center, training center, and CNG gas refilling station is part of our commitment to the renewed hope agenda of Mr. President. His vision for diversified sustainable and industrial vibrant economy is clear. And today's launch is another practical step towards making that vision a reality. Naseni has shown itself to be a pioneer not content to simply oversee projects but determined to create it with the able leadership of my brother Mr. Khalil Sulaim. By embracing collaboration they have proven that development in Nigeria can be both rapid and responsive. CNG a cleaner burning alternative to petrol and diesel has gained renewed traction in Nigeria following rising fuel costs and the official policy shift towards renewable and alternative energy sources. Countries like Argentina and Pakistan have also transitioned millions of vehicles to CNG, a path that Nigerian lawmakers and energy experts say the country can also follow. Compressed National Guard CNG has energized as a strategic bridge fuel cleaner than petrol and diesel, cheaper for consumers and abundant in nations such as ours. Countries like Argentina, Pakistan and Iran have successfully converted millions of vehicles, CNG saving billions in fuel costs and reducing urban air pollution. Why can't we, as a nation, also transition from fossil fuels, fossil fuel to CNG? This commissioning marks another important milestone in Nigeria's journey toward achieving our energy transition goals. The partnership between Naseni and Portland is a clear example of how private sector plays a vital role in driving our nation's economic growth and development. As government, our role is to act as a catalyst, unlocking private sector expertise and capital to deliver meaningful results for the Nigerian people. On this note, let me commend Naseni under the leadership 
of the EBC, Mr. Kaleo Halilu, for its strong support of the administration's initiatives across multiple sectors. Your example sets the pace for other government institutions as we work together to deliver on the President's transformational promises. At the Presidency, we remain committed to creating an enabling environment for energy investment in Nigeria. These Naseni Portland CNG Conversion and Training Center also will act as skills development hub where many engineers across Nigeria will be trained in CNG conversion and clean energy maintenance, thereby creating a new generation of homegrown experts.